Hello Hodgshaw, welcome to today's homework. I'm working at speed, distance and time. Okay, so we've already done speed, so we're gonna have a go at distance and time. The average speed of the train is four meters per second. It reached the distance of 120 meters. Find the time taken by the train to travel this distance. Okay, so the first things first, we write down S, D and T and write down our known information. Okay, the information we know is speed is 4 meters per second. Okay, and the distance is 120 meters. So we need to find the time. So I'm going to cover up time over here. So it leaves us with time equals to distance divided by speed. Time equals distance divided by speed. Now, don't forget our speed is in meters per second, so the distance should be in meters and the time should be in seconds. So putting all our values into our formula, where the distance is 120 and the speed is 4, we get 120 divided by 4 equals 30. And that's 30 seconds. Okay, let's write down S, D and T again. Write down our known information. A car travels 50 miles. That means the distance is 50 miles at 30 miles per hour. Okay, it's 30 miles per hour. Calculate the time taken for the journey. Give your answer in hours and minutes. So, we need to work out time. I'm going to cover up time. So, time equals to distance divided by speed. Our distance is 50 and our speed is 30. So, that gives me 1.666 recurring. So, it should just be 1.6 recurring hours so to convert that into hours and minutes I have one hour and I need to multiply the 0 0.666 by 60 okay and that gives me one hour and 40 minutes Okay, I'll put a word wall on. I would like you to go on to click on the link in, on class charts and have a go at this word wall. Once you have finished, take a screenshot of your results and post it on class charts. Good luck.